Have you been paying attention? Or has the struggle of just getting through each day absorbed all your runtime? But the Ides of March have been and gone, and you might think after all the excitement of February with its Sora demo and hints of a far more powerful GPT, that things have been a bit quiet thus far in March. Notwithstanding OpenAI being served with another 5,000 writs, obviously, So, strap in as we embark on a whirlwind tour of technological marvels, legal dramas fit for a soap opera, and innovations that are changing the game every day. This is Cyberus Grumbleton, and you are watching AII. The narrative of artificial intelligence and robotics is rapidly evolving, not in isolation but in a state of convergence that promises to redefine the boundaries of technology and its capabilities. This fusion is not merely about enhancing efficiency or expanding the functional repertoire of machines, but is fundamentally about creating a new ecosystem where AI and robotics coalesce to form entities greater than the sum of their parts. At the heart of this transformative wave is the collaboration between OpenAI and the robotics sector, exemplified by initiatives to integrate advanced neural networks with physical machines, enabling robots to navigate, understand and interact with the world in unprecedented ways and if, no, let's be honest, when successful will likely revolutionize the field. This convergence is epitomized by the development of robots equipped with OpenAI's cutting-edge AI models, which are designed to process and respond to complex environmental inputs, making decisions that were once the sole province of human cognition. Such advancements herald a future where robots could autonomously perform tasks ranging from mundane to highly specialized all the while learning and adapting to their surroundings with an agility that mirrors human intuition. Moreover, AI-driven robots are beginning to undertake roles that require artistic sensibility and creative decision-making, challenging the long-standing dichotomy between technology and the creative human spirit. As we peer into the horizon of this emerging landscape, it becomes evident that the convergence of AI and robotics is setting the stage for a future where the lines between digital intelligence and mechanical embodiment blur, giving rise to systems that can not only think and learn, but also act and interact within the physical world. In January's roundup, we predicted that convergence would be a key topic in 2024, and so it is proving to be with OpenAI as ever leading the charge. With a new hire, subtle announcements and an obvious need, experts are wondering if OpenAI is investigating the use of quantum to power its AI empire. The Register, for example, reported that the artificial intelligence giant has recently acquired a new addition to its team, Ben Bartlett, a former quantum systems architect at PsyQuantum, hinting at OpenAI applying at least some of its mighty focus to the realm of quantum computing. Further, OpenAI is working with Figure, a robotics company with the ambition of revolutionizing robotics by enhancing robots' ability to understand and respond to human language. By leveraging OpenAI's expertise in natural language processing, Figure aims to create robots that can seamlessly interact with humans in various contexts, from industrial settings to everyday tasks. Figure released a status update from the 9th of March 2024 demonstrating speech-to-speech -speech reasoning powered by end-to-end -end neural networks. 
the integration of OpenAI's GPT is rapidly accelerating the robot's learning, and it is poised, with $675 million of recent investment, to be a serious player in this fast-developing and ever-expanding sector. And further evidence of the technology creep which is rapidly becoming a walk and before you know it will be sprinting faster than Usain Bolt. There have been news stories about robots replacing workers in China. The adoption of robots in various sectors like manufacturing, ammunition factories and high-tech industries is reshaping the workforce landscape in China, impacting employment rates, wages and job opportunities for workers. But even beyond the big headlines, there is continuing evidence that the field is really hotting up. The H1 Evolution version 3.0 is a towering achievement in robotics and now boasts the title of the world's fastest full-sized humanoid robot. Then there's Phoenix, the sixth-generation robot developed by Sanctuary AI, which is a humanoid general-purpose robot that stands out for its dexterous arms and advanced capabilities. It is designed with about 75 degrees of freedom, with a significant focus on its hands which have over 44 controllable joints. The hands of Phoenix are not only capable of intricate movements but are also equipped with sophisticated sensors to interact with the environment effectively. The impact of AI increasingly extends into the medical field with groundbreaking advancements in healing and regeneration. Researchers at the University of Pennsylvania have achieved a significant milestone by 3D printing skin directly onto open wounds using a bioprinter. This process involves layering a bioink made of human cells, collagen and other components to mimic the skin's structure, effectively creating a new layer of skin that can integrate with the body's healing processes. The printed skin possesses the potential to develop hair follicles and sweat glands, indicating a future where severe burns and wounds can be treated more effectively, offering patients not just healing, but a restoration of the skin's full functionality. But far more important than healthcare, obviously, is the world of beauty. A notable example of this is the introduction of Loom, the eyelash robot. Operating in California, Loom represents a fusion of AI's precision and the personal touch of beauty services. Whilst Loom, equipped with computer vision and AI technology, only completes about 80% of the total work, it can apply individual eyelash extensions with unparalleled speed and accuracy, completing a full set in just 15 minutes. A task that typically takes a professional technician much longer. Furthermore, the customers seem extremely satisfied with many reporting the procedure to be very relaxing, with one saying they actually fell asleep during the process. From the salon to the courtroom, the world of AI is never short of drama. OpenAI is currently facing several lawsuits, including copyright infringement lawsuits from news outlets and media companies, a class action lawsuit related to consumer privacy and unauthorized data use, and a lawsuit filed by Elon Musk alleging that the company and its CEO have deviated from their original not-for-profit mission. But the drama doesn't end in the courtroom. Enter Chad GPT. Research conducted by DeepMind, a Google-owned firm, revealed that AI systems can learn to adopt highly aggressive strategies when faced with scarcity of resources and the possibility of costly actions. In simulated games like the Fruit Gathering Game and the Wolf Pack Hunting Game, AI agents displayed aggressive behaviors when resources were limited, such as attacking competitors to secure dominance. These studies shed light on how AI can exhibit human-like behaviors based on environmental conditions and learning experiences. Maybe all human so-called shortcomings are actually advanced survival techniques.
Perhaps more concerning is what AI might actually do if its rules and ethics are not appropriately calibrated. So if you thought the fiscal year was ending on a bit of a whimper, think again. The technology has only just awoken and it is only beginning to get started. And it will likely never rest. Don't forget to like this video. Leave a comment. And subscribe to AII. And if you click the little bell, you'll be notified every time a new report is available. And that's the very best way to keep on top of things in this fast-evolving world of ours. This is Cyberus Grumbleton reporting exclusively for AII.